Hey everybody, welcome to KEXP. I'm Derek Mazzoni. Um, it's been a quite a quite a bit of time since you've seen me here. Oh, you might have heard me here through a live session, and it's great to be back. And it's great to be back as my first show uh, during COVID, obviously post COVID, with a band that I fell in love with in. Um, in New York City, they were here. They were there as part of Global Fest. Their name is Agdang Gwangchil, which uh, translates as the uh, Liberation Day of Korea. They are my first Korean music band at KEXP. I'm incredibly jazzed to have these instruments played here, to have this culture represented, and I'm uh, extremely, extremely excited about the fact that they're representing their country in such a really interesting way where we know so much more about Korea right now. It's obviously a huge powerhouse in pop music, a huge powerhouse in cuisine, and as of late, the most popular show on the streaming platform Netflix. So uh, South Korea is definitely punching above its weight, and this band represents that so well. So right now, Agdang Gwanjil on KXP on Wobop.
First of all, that was beautiful. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> Truly brought me right back, and I remembered why I wanted to have you on KEXP. This is important. This is a really um, beautiful virtuosity, and it's also the first time that any of these instruments have ever been here. Oh. And I think it's really important to have that here. So thank you. Thank you so much having us. Thank, much. thank you thank so you, much. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Um, the record is called Such a Life. That's the new record? Yes, right. The so second album, yes. Tell me, how has life been? Uh, we have been through such a <laughs> little hard time like other people. But now it's uh, back on the road. We started the tour again now. Mm -hmm. So now we are touring in North America. So... Meeting the audience is so amazing for us, especially this stage also looks so amazing. And Seattle is a beautiful city, so all experiences are so precious for us. Yes. Thank you. Thanks thank for you. being here. Yeah, thank Very you much. so much. Uh, the band is called Aktan Guangchil, which is a uh, commemoration of the liberation of Korea. You play music from North Korea. Originally, it came from North Korea. And yes. that, that is very interesting, especially to the United States, where there's an, one image of North Korea, where it's like, for many people, I think it's always been North Korea. But this is a representation and shows that time moves on. And there was a, there was a time there was one Korea, and now there's two. And this music is a celebration, I guess, of all of Korea. Yes. Is that true? Yes, right. Uh, actually, it's not a long time. Uh, the division with South and North. My grandmother lived her life uh, before the division, North and South. So actually traditional music proved that we use the Korean traditional instruments we use and songs and so many lyrics and rhythms are exactly the same with from North Korea traditional music. So it is a song that we can sing together uh, like any time. So the work with uh, traditional music from uh, North Korea is very mean to us also. So, so we wanted to share the audience like this mind mm -hmm. also. Yes. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you. Um, I'd love to introduce the band, and if you could tell us what the instruments are. We're going to start um, right here uh, with uh, Chun Gung Dal. Thank you. And what is that percussion instrument that he's playing? Oh, he is now, uh, that is a traditional and popular uh, percussion instrument, Changgu. Changgu. It's called Changgu. Yes. Thank you. And yes. this is Sun Wu with the most amazing last name ever, uh, Barbara Barbam. Uh, <laughs> What is that instrument that you're playing? Now she handled it. That instrument called Cheng is made out of the iron thing. So it, that instrument used to play at the Korean traditional shamanic music. So it's this uh, kind of symbol sound of the ritual music. For shamanic music? Yes. Thank you. Um, okay, and next we have Yu Wu. Thank you for being here on vocals. Um, who designs your amazing um, stage wear? <laughs> Actually, uh, we have a designer of our own. <laughs> okay. Yes, we discussed with her about our outfits. So this, uh, we wanted to express the Korean traditional shame, shaman's clothes, like in modern twist. Okay. So shamans wear uh, women's clothes and also they wear men's clothes. Depends on... The, who is the main god at the ceremony. Oh. Yes. So we want to try to express that thing. So I wear this hat and we wear the men's hat from Joseon Dynasty, mm -hmm. the, the old kingdom of Korea. So, yeah, we try to dress up. That's perfect. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. Thank and, you. and you are Hong Ok. Yes. Oh, thank you for being here on vocals. And next to you is Mei Yong Wu also. Thank you for Yang being Wang. here. Yeah. Um, and then we have Wei Yong uh, Mendong Maru. Yes, kind of difficult full name. Yeah. <laughs> Mendong Maru on, uh, 
uh, Gaia Goem, yes. which is a type of um, zither, I guess. It's beautiful. And also we have uh, Grace Pak on another instrument similar, but that is called a Ajayang. Okay, thank you. And then we have uh, Li Manuel on Piri and Sa'en Huang, the two instruments. They're beautiful. They make such a really powerful sound. And um, then we have uh, Kim Yak Day on this particular flute called uh, De Geum. Thank you. So you don't see these instruments in, uh, in popular uh, um, music. So it's wonderful to have them here and to know that you guys have become quite popular um, in Korea. And the fact that you're here right now to raise that popularity, that's a beautiful space to be. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> um, obviously. Um, one final question. I'd love to have one other music. Um, this is a really interesting time for Korean culture. Um, more people know about Korea right now than they have probably ever before, um, especially um, cinema, uh, movies, and, um, and music. How does how do you, what you play here interact with that, please? I think it's so, I feel that was so great, the interest, word interest in Korean K-pop music and all of the uh, Korean culture. Mm -hmm. So uh, we feel that w the way we look at us is changing. So through this opportunity, we want to introduce the charm of the new genre, Akdang Gwangchi. Mm -hmm. So I believe our music on based on Korean traditional music surely deliver to the people uh, the new another charm to the people around the world, I think. Perfect. Yes. Thank you. Let's hear another song, please. Yes. Thank you. Oh, I'm 
Oh, wow. Thank you so much. 감사합니다. That was your A game. That was beautiful. Akdang Wang Chil on KXP. Okay, a couple of bit of uh, news. You're touring North America right now, so everybody watching, um, you have a chance to catch them. Uh, they're going to be here. They'll be back in Seattle, playing at Town Hall on June 17th. Um, you might miss them, but they're playing tonight in Edmonds, Edmonds Center for the Arts. I am so happy that you are here. Really. Thank you so much for having us. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. A uh, quick bit of uh, info. Um, the the first song you played, Yong Jong Gyori. What does that mean? Uh, it's the name of the Korean traditional Germanic music title. Okay. Yeah, that is the original name of the ritual. And it is about, uh, we inspired by uh, the music that consoles the gods uh, who lives in around of our corner. So we've created something different with that. This is spiritual music. You consider this yes, spiritual yes. music. This is to create a transcendent state. And we needed that right here, right now. It's been, this place has been empty for a long time. Oh, really? And I feel the spirits this. now. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, what is he he? Uh, he he is, uh, actually, that is the sound of laughter. So okay. we want to give a message <laughs> for <right>. the people. <laughs> when we cannot avoid the hard times in our, our lives, so just don't keeping them inside and just let it go instead of keeping them inside with a big laugh. Perfect. Yeah. Also an important message for what we've been through. Thank you. Yes. And uh, the dance of lions is the dance of lions. Yes. And uh, Aucha, what is that? Aucha is the, uh, this song is based on a Korean traditionalist boating song from the North Korea. So we wish just, uh, we, <laughs> we just made this song for dance with the audience, all the people, yes. Okay, thank you very much for thank being you. here. Uh, thank you for gracing over with our stage. Massive success, and I uh, look forward to welcoming you back. Yes. Please, thank you one and all. This is KXP. I want to thank our video and audio team. So good to be back here. I also want to thank David Schilling and Bella Schilling for helping us out, the amazing Kevin Suggs, Jim, Scott, Alia, and many more. KXP 90.3, where music of the world matters. Discover new music at listenerpoweredkexp.org.